video it is Carol Shea here if you're new hey love and thank you for clicking on this video I hope you decide to join the family by subscribing down below if you've been with me for a while thank you for running along with me because we're on the way to a come up now today's video it is March it's March 28th and so it's time for my monthly favorites this is gonna be a new little series I'm about to start every month I'm gonna try new things I'm gonna try it out for the entire month and I'm gonna come back and tell you the goods and the bads mainly goods because they're my favorites right monthly favorites so it's gonna be some hygiene some skincare some makeup some music like what's popping this month so if you would like to hear a little bit more keep watching the video and I'll see you in my next one all right so to start this off I just want to say um I realized ever since I've been in college honey my mom been a little bad no cap um so I'm at, I had to make a list y'all think I'm lying I had to make a list so we're going to start let's see we're not gonna do music right now okay so we're gonna start with my skincare y'all know I'm a big skin fanatic like I like washing my face every morning and every night that shit make my that just make you feel clean that just make you feel good that's the best way to wake yourself up in the morning so for skincare so Aveeno it's an Aveeno Clear Complexion, and it's a cream cleanser, but it's also, it's mainly a blemish treatment, and it really does work. Let me see if I can put it in the camera. I'm going to put the titles and prices of everything in the description box, Um, but, honey, I used to have blemishes all on the side of my faces, and mainly on my forehead. I probably, right now, yeah, I kind of have a slight breakout on my forehead, but this blemish truly does work. Like, you use it, you start Monday. You gonna see some results Wednesday, like no doubt, really good. And then I was y'all, if y'all remember in my um, Black Friday haul, I purchased this tea tree um, facial wash. It works really good too. I mean, I use both of these together, so it's like a blemish and it's just like a little bit more cleanser. It feels like very moisturizing, and you can feel like it working, like the sensation of it working. I love it. Been using it every day. Ain't nothing wrong with it. I highly recommend it. <laughs> Go get you some. Now this is new new. You said to get the small bottle because I know if I was gonna like it or not. It's the um Thayer's Thayer's. Don't know how to pronounce it. It's a facial toner. I know most people be like, oh, you're dark skin. What do you need a toner for? Um, it's not necessarily gonna change my skin color, honey. It's more like it's gonna brighten your face a little bit. And this one is mainly um cucumber and it is also alcohol free. If you don't like it, get the small bottle. No money wasted. <laughs> and another thing for skincare. Well, this isn't really skincare. This kind of goes with makeup. But I use a lot of stuff to take off my makeup. But this Clinique Take the Day Off, y'all, I've used it this entire month. Look how much it lasts you forever. Like, and it was like $20, 24 I'm going to list it below. But it lasts a really long time and I really like it. So, ain't nothing wrong with it. So next to, since we're working on facial skincare, I'm just keep it in the midst. I'm going next to makeup. <laughs> my makeup favorites, it's more than likely y'all have seen me. I mean, I know I've been done in a makeup tutorial in a while, which I am going to get back to posting videos. But um, it's some stuff that y'all have more than likely seen me use. And y'all, it's this one new thing that I got. Ladies, it's amazing. <laughs> All right, so let's get started. So my first thing. Lancome Tinted All Foundation. So my color is 540 um, Sue W Mean and Warm. It's really good. Like, it's a pretty big bottle. It's got the little dispenser. It lasts you a while. Cause I first, the first time I tried it, I got the tester. You know, I, if I'm not gonna like it, I need to wait till either I'm gonna return it or I'm just not gonna go get it. So I got a tester and I love it. It, I will say it oxidizes a little bit. But hmm, it doesn't look like too bad. As long as you get something around that's either if, if you can find something that's perfect your color, or at least around it, you can barely tell that it oxidizes. And the next thing is this color pop concealer. I don't know who did it, but they did it because this. Everyone that I work with at Ulta says that this is a NARS dupe. When I say a NARS dupe, I mean that it has the consistency and the quality of a NARS concealer. It's actually a little bit more um, product inside. 
but it's from ColourPop and it's cheaper. I think it was like six dollars, six or eight dollars. But and it works amazing. Like the color, it it looks kind of light, but I, I use it today. Flawless. <laughs> So I love this. I use it anytime I do a full face, and I, but I will say I do have to get the darker shade just in case. Like I want to use it whenever I just don't get enough sleep without doing a full face. But overall, ColourPop, y'all did that. I'm not mad at all. I'm not mad at all. Next thing I have just fell in love with is this. Is my second time purchasing this. It's the NYX Butter Gloss. I wish they had the um Ultra Gloss, Extra. No, it's Intense Butter Gloss. Wish they had that. But this is the color Ginger Snap. Have it on right now. If y'all see me looking up here, I'm looking at my mirror. Look at myself. <laughs> so, um, yes, their butter gloss is amazing. I don't know. I don't have the um I don't have the other lightest color I have in this. But another one of my favorite lip glosses have been Morphe. This is the color Freebird, but Freebird and I think the other color is Pixie. These are honey. If y'all I spent thirty dollars on some lip gloss that y'all barely like. Y'all need to go back and redo some things. NYX and Morphe, cheap lip glosses work amazingly and they last a while. So hey, ladies, I'm helping you out. Okay, Morphe, it works. It's amazing. I love it. Okay, and going back to Morphe, y'all know I love Morphe. I can't count. I love me some Morphe. So this is the highlight palette. It is eight S highlight palette. I I know I should have kept the box. It's a gorgeous box. It's like a red and black box. A little velvety. <laughs> this is the palette. Do y'all see them colors though? Like, I'm sorry. I might I might not use this color. But everything else I more likely will use. Like, I love this palette. Like, yes, Morphe. So yes, every time I do a full face, I use this. Um, I used it today. If you can tell. <laughs> but yes, Morphe, Morphe, Morphe. Okay, so that's going to be all for the makeup and skincare. Now we're going to move over to, like, hygiene, basically. So, for Christmas, my mom gave me this. It was a pack of pink from the store pink. It was like the lotion or oil. This lotion is coconut oil lotion. It's amazing. Like, the scent. Yeah, I see how much gone. I love this lotion. I literally use this lotion every single day. Like, when, you, when I say ash away, ash away. <laughs> But this lotion is a bomb. Um, I also tried something new this month. I tried the Dove Spray deodorant. Um, I've never. I usually don't even use Dove. I use what do I use? I think it's Secret because their scent is really strong and it really stays a long time. But with this a dry spray, and sometimes depending on how you spray it, it doesn't show up. So like ladies, you know it's like you do your deodorant before you get dressed. You got pull some over your head. It don't leave, leave that little white little white mark on you. Um, it's last me a good amount because I've actually had this since since January, and I mean it spray. That's not something. It spray pretty good too. Because this I do recommend trying just because it's a different way. I mean, come on. Who who gets tired of doing all that? No, no, no just no, no. keep going. Period. Okay, and my perfumes of the month. If you if you can't tell, this almost gone. This almost gone too. They are both from Victoria's Secrets. This one's called Good Vibes or Goodbye. Period. This one's called Tropical Citrus. They both smell. Oh my god, this smells so good. They both smell amazing. Um, they were $18. Yeah. But you know, Victoria's Secrets always having some type of sale. And y'all already know I Victoria's Secrets, that's my place. Victoria don't tell nobody. <laughs> but these are gonna be my favorite two perfumes. Um, this one, I don't believe it smells like citrus. To me, it smells like pineapple or mango, but I guess it's because it is tropical, so but it does smell really good. So another lotion I love, like this is like my stay at home lotion. This right here is in my in the purse lotion, and this is called Happy Vibes, honey. We're we're all about good vibes over here, okay? Now this specifically is from Bath and Body Works. This, I mean, a little goes a long way because honestly, with this always being in my purse, I only use it for like my feet, my ankles when I'm ashy, <laughs> my hands. So like I haven't really used that much, but it's amazing and it smells so good. And I recommend it. <laughs> now we're about to go into some of my favorite songs. So my first song, Kay Can't Pee With Hers. 
if y'all ain't listen to it, I'm gonna clip, clip it. If y'all ain't heard this song, ladies, I need to listen to this, okay? Because baby, honey, child. She got a long. What we got? She got a long. Pull up, she gon' pull up too. You can buy that, she can buy that too. So that's a K-Camp song. <laughs> His and hers. My next favorite song. Oh my gosh, y'all. I know, I feel like some ladies, I know, and some guys. I know y'all like this song. Y'all got to. It's called Worth It. If you're all alone. Let me stop. All right, so that is my, and I'm doing the top three. So my third one, I'm gonna just surprise y'all with this last one, cause I don't, I don't think y'all gonna expect it. I don't think y'all gonna expect it. But this is my third favorite song of the month. Who you a vote for this one? Oh Lord, Jesse made another one. Huh? Back in the mail, it's gone. Uh -huh. She like I smell cologne. Yeah, I just had to deal them on. So those are my top three favorite songs of the month and last but not least i mean i guess they are one of my favorite they will have to, i still have to be my favorite movies of the month just because these are the two movies i went to go see and they are the medea what's it called the a medea family funeral and this now y'all already know Medea movies, them, them movies be funny as hell, okay, no cap. So y'all already know I love that movie. I've been watching Medea since I was little. I got every single one of that, her plays on DVD. I got every single one of his movies on DVD. Like, everybody love Medea. Now this Us movie, it's okay, calm down. I'm not about to spoil that if you ain't seen it. Cause I'm not, I don't even like spoilers myself. But, that movie pissed me off. But it's okay. I watched Get Out, and Get Out was a really good movie. In this movie, I just need them to have a part two so, to make it better than what it is. But if you ain't seen it, go watch it. You need to watch it. Just have your own perception of it. It was all right. It was. That is the end of my March 2019 monthly favorites. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. Join the family, and there will be many more videos on the way. I promise y'all, I'm, I'm doing better in 2019, period. See you in my next video.